Hello, how are you all doing? It's Mighty Chlorophyte here, and welcome back to Let's Play Portal 2. In the um, last part, we have met Wheatley, began our journey through the overgrowths and ruins of Aperture, and got our singular portal device. Not only that, for this part, I am joined by a very good friend of mine. Say hi. Hello. Yes. Yes, this is my friend. We're just gonna call him Barry. Yay! <clears throat> and well, he won't really be paying attention to what I'm doing. He's playing another game. But hey, we're at least both of us are playing Valve games. That that's good, right? I would think so. You would think so. Why this voice? Anyway. I, okay, I have no. I don't know what the hell that was supposed to be. But we're but, just gonna, uh, we're just gonna go with that. Yeah, I'm just gonna. No, I Yeah, my friend is a little crazy, but we'll just go with it. <laughs> That's the pot calling the kettle black. <laughs> ah, okay. Anyway, this next test is very oh. dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed. <gasps> it's the smooth three, jazz! Two, one. Oh, oh really? This smooth. next test is dangerous? Since when are the tests safe? Yeah, I know. Oh, the smooth jazz is slowing. I'm kinda sad now. <laughs> Anyway, it is time to go on with this test, which was, in fact, from the original portal. And... <clears throat> wow. What I Man. just did there was, um, like, you know, pop a portal right below where the cube is falling, and make the cube land on the button, like that. You actually get an and achievement for doing that. It's, um, I believe Dropbox. Okay. You know what? Man, these puzzles aren't holding up to what they used to be. Yes, because everything all looks all shitty. Look at how, look at how destroyed it is. Oh, right, the Too cube is in there. It's a shame that um you don't. It's a shame that the main character can't like fly. This message is pre-recorded. Yeah. Any observations related to your performance I mean, you are think speculation that they could on our use the portal device to disregard any undeserved I don't know, open a way out of there or climb the wreckage I mean yeah <clears throat> that sounds like a thing that could happen but and this was in the original portal that wasn't <clears throat> and if we go <laughs> this is where we're supposed to go but uh, if we go through here there's some more Doug Ratman scroll Ah, dang it, a hiccup. I just had lunch, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, unreason. And a bunch of math equations, and this is most likely referring to um, Erwin Schrodinger's paradox. You know, ah, cat ah. in the box. Yeah, oh. well, you know what they say, dead or alive until someone opens the box. Uh, <laughs> not, not really, he's, with, he's at the librarian's library. Anyway, we continue testing. We will continue testing for home country. Oh, um, <clears throat> also, something I would like to point out. My inspirations for making videos of gaming are, um, <clears throat> Tear of Grace, which is a... I don't think he's really well known, but he's really funny. And obviously, Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, um, PewDiePie... A lot of other channels, but let's keep going. If the enrichment center is currently kind of look like the, those little walking guys over there, it kind of looks like they're walking away in unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate <laughs> part of the test. <laughs> and then they just respawn. Like, it, no, <laughs> it looks like they're river dancing, doesn't it? It kind of looks, I don't know, like, from my end, it kind of looks like they're river dancing. I'm not. Yeah, remember your evacuation training. Oh, yes, because doing river dancing is part of the evacuation. Yes. 
<laughs> anyway. You, gotta, you have to evacuate in style! <laughs> yes. By being fabulous. Anyway. Press it. Stand on this button. Last and, time I checked it, it came out way before Undertale. So, fabulous wasn't... With style wasn't, like, the concept. Yeah, so you press this button here. Yay. And retrieve but this cube to have that cube press that button and make, make this these stairs for us. And now press this button and the cube will fall but into the liquid too. And this button activates those panels. So what you gotta do is apply some timing. Alright, and up. Oh. And there we go. I'm smart. Well, I'm not I, I'm not really smart. It's just the fact that I've been playing this game for god knows how long now. Both console and PC. Well done. The enrichment yeah, is really minor. Prepared Although circumstances like, may appear oh, to you are not alone. All the temperature science personality yeah. constructs will remain yeah. functional in apocalyptic you, low power you environments. Got those, you got, got that one dingleberry that will probably just go, Oh, you're not playing this blind? Ugh. Mm, yes. Even you got the best of me. You got it. Ugh. Ugh. Do that voice, maybe yawn. Um, nom, 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 nom. Please remain calm. Look at that. So happy. Anyway. What if this next what test applies the principles of not to be calm. movement through ports? <laughs> if the laws of physics no longer apply oh. in the future. God help, help you. you. <laughs> if si if yeah, if that no longer applies in the future, God help you. Anyway. You, this is basically introducing momentum for those of you who have not played the original Portal game, or so, at least wait. not heard of it. So wait, the announcer guy is like, I don't know, if, if, saying he believes in God or something? Speaking for Gladys? Yeah, cause, you know, she's dead. Okay, now we have to make a leap of faith! Mm -hmm. Yay. If you are a non-employee <laughs> who has discovered this facility and made the rules of civilization, what? welcome. And remember, testing it's, is the future. That's what I was saying. The future was like, I don't want to go through. And then it just like pops through the other side. Ah, crap! <laughs> ah. <clears throat> he popped in there for the sake of self-loathing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Also, I would like to point out that my friend of mine here, they're <coughs> currently, um, well, he's planning on making a, a new gaming, well, new channel. Why did I say gaming channel? I'm a, I don't know. I might try and do gaming in the future. I need yeah. better. I need to get stuff first. But. Okay. But anyway. What you do is what you've been seeing, and then you just put the cube on the button. You know there was a faster way you could have done that. You could have just smashed that glass. That yeah, glass but you can't do that in this game. <laughs> yes, you can. I've seen people do it all the time. That's it. If you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way, the should not start with you. Please return to your primitive tribe. I would have done it. Qualified for testing. <clears throat> Primitive tribe. Uh, um. Also, also, I would like to point out, even if you could, it, if you, if you were able to break glass in this game, which you can, I think. Hey, I think it would be a pain in the glass. Oh, brother. Hey, David. You know how you're playing Portal? Yes. Uh, so, so you know how I usually start up a practice map before I actually start playing the game. Team Fortress 2, you mean? Yeah, guess what? what? The method on my team is named Companion Q. Ah! Uh, <laughs> that, so, that is so fitting! We got a scout here named Saxton Hale. Who is, who's named Gladys? 
Um, let's see. Let's see. Um, no, it doesn't look. Oh wait, we have an our engineer's name Delicious Cake. Wow. There is no guy in here named Gladys, but one of them's also named. But one of the enemy team members is named Divided by Zero. Is there any Chell? Ooh, uh, no. Dang it. <clears throat> well, anyway, <clears throat> on to another test, it looks like, but these original mechanics in, uh, from the original Portal game seem to have stopped working. Hey! Oi, oi! Oh, hey, there's oh, Wheatley! Hey. You did find a Portal gun! Yes, I did. Oh, the, do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Yeah, they... Brave. Maybe? Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the you other side. You better run, tiny coward. Heavy is... Heavy is coming for Just you. Just pop a portal right behind me there, and come on through to the other side. <clears throat> yeah. Unfortunately, these original mechanics from Portal 1 pop we won't be using. Portal. Just there. All right behind me, and come on through. I get it, Wheatley. Okay. Alright, uh, what you got uh, for me, Wheatley? Okay, listen, let me... Lay something on you. First point. Wait, point. First they point. They told me yeah. never, never, yeah. ever to disengage myself never from my management rail. From the rail. Or I would die. Or you would but die. But we're out of options here. So Actually, get ready to catch me. Or you right, would On the die. other chance uh, that I'm not I dead. I got killed the by I live and one man on cheeseburger you. apocalypse. Ready? Good one. for you. All right, ready? I'm going to catch you. Three. D that's oh. high. It's w it's too high, oh. isn't it? Really? That. Okay. All right. Going high. on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one. Right, this one. one. Okay. Ready? All right. Ready? One. Catch me! Ah. Catch me! Catch me! Catch me! I Ow. got him. Ow. <laughs> Dong. I am not dead. I'm not dead. Oh, 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 Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah, and I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. <laughs> okay. We're gonna plug him into that thing there. The kind oh, of sounds weird. Jeremy in over there. I, I just gotta sit and listen to Wheatley's dialogue. Right on that stick, over there. Just put me right on it. What are you doing just standing there, to Companion Cube? Help me kill these enemies! Remember, Gladys once said that the Companion Cube cannot move and tricky. speak. It is tricky. But, um, just. Yeah, tell that in, to this please. Companion Cube. <laughs> who's, not only, who's not only healing me, but uh, is. Also following plug me around that stick on the wall so over I there. can shoot enemies. I'll show you something. All right, let's just plug Wheatley in. Um, I hate to say yeah, this, I but I look. Watching. My character looks like Mad Seriously, Max. I'm not, I'm not joking. Just, Can you just turn around for a second. That the, he, and he decided to wear a sweater and a base and like a baseball cap. Okay. By the way, we're not really here watching. to talk about Team Fortress Two right now. Well, you should have thought I'm, about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, do that. I can't do it if you're watching. If you just turn around. No, I want to watch you do it. Come on, I don't want to turn around. Well, he might. He might be like. I don't know. Socially awkward. He might be What's tempting. That you? It's only a robot, a bloody stick. A oh, different one. Oh. Okay, let's see. Uh, ah. Ah. Medic, you're doing a lousy job of healing right. me. <laughs> Can't do it if you're if you're leering at me. It's creepy. <laughs> leering at you. Okay, fine. All right, you can turn around now. Okay. Bam. I already did. Secret panel. Ah, right. Look right, at that. that turn. Pick me up. Or let's get out of here. All right, let's get it. And off we go. All right, let's go. Look at this. No rail to tell us where to go. Look at oh, that. This is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just hold on there. Where All are right. we going? Uh, Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um. Just follow the rail, actually. Yeah, let's just follow the rail. Uh, oh, oh. Oh, no. It's all right. Yes. Hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No. Victory thanks. for me. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Thanks, Keep moving. anyway. Hello. Hi. Hello. This turret is so cute, though. I'm different. He's different. And we have some cubes there and a different kind of cube, which we won't know what it does until later in the game. So we just... Take Wheatley with us. This is going well so far. Ugh. Okay. 
Ain't this a fun times for all? Ain't this a fun time for all? Speed on something Great right now. In order to escape, we I have to go through her mail. chamber. You, and you she will call the cats if, if she's um, awake. <laughs> you want to just call it quits? Oh. And we could just sit here. So and then, she and that's is an in option. Air. Option A, sit here, do nothing. Option B, go through there. Trigger. And if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. It's not trigger so, happy. If you've got any reservations so. whatsoever about this plan, now would be a tremendous time to voice them. <clears throat> right so, now. So, um, our options are In case a, you thought to yourself, uh, I've missed the window of time to voice my reservations. Still open. So our choices is are A, sit here forever and eventually die, or two, or B, go through there and risk, risk the chances of us getting killed in the process. Now, normally, I'm not I'm not so stupid, right? So uh, we're gonna go through the stupid option. Jeez, how, how, look how ruined that looks. Jeez. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna go in there. Don't, don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> and there's the thing we saw in the beginning of the game. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Darn sex nail, you took my ammo. Do you know who ended up, uh, do you know who wow. ended up down in the end? You're not going to believe this. He, a human. He's the animal. I know, I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long <clears> chunk <throat> of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch me. Wow. Poor, um, poor GLaDOS. Uh, this, is, this is, in fact, what you all viewers saw in the beginning of my first video. But yeah, what we have to do is... Go through here. And there's the incinerator that we burned all the cores in in the first game. Okay, Benny Stairs. Mother Hubbard. Actually, look at that is quite a really? distance. Really? That's a name that can, okay, you know what? can uh, generate big, you've mean got mother braces Hubbard. On your legs, so you're all set. Yeah. Although no braces on your arms. Okay, though, there's so a you're going to have to rely on the old human strength to keep a grip big, on the mean device. Mother Hubbard. Um, <laughs> okay, so but anyway, I'm really going to have to jump down also, a, a note, height no braces on your spine that we either. Lee thinks so, that so I'm going to die that. from um, or your head, even no though I've there. been that through could, worse split like a heights. melon from this height <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, um, that doesn't look so very do far definitely now. focus on landing with your legs Alright, let's do that! Oh, still I think he's just uh, being, being a big That's a great job, you've applied the grit, we're all fine yes. That's tremendous Yes, I have a good grip on you, Wheatley, don't worry But, we are going to end the um, video here so, sorry, but we're going to end it here. So next time on <clears throat> Let's Play Portal 2, we are going to hopefully get out of here with the help of Wheatley. All right, so say goodbye. Bye. That's your best bye. Hey. It, it, it was an unintentional joke.